Welcome, my so name is uh, Xiaomi Redmi 9 and today I'll show you how to transfer files from your phone to an SD card and vice versa. So to get started we'll need to open up the files app which I'm not exactly sure where it is so let me quickly find it and there it is. So file manager, simply tap on it, it's allow and then a new feature is cancelled. So from here you want to tap on the folder right over here. And by default, it's going to go to the internal storage, which means to the storage of the device itself. Um, and then here you can look for your files. And now I believe mine will be right in here. And yep, surely they are here. So um, as a brief uh, guide, DCIM folder will contain videos, as you can see, uh, videos, screenshots, uh, camera recordings, and just camera photos in here. Then you have things like the downloads folder which will contain anything that i have downloaded either through your web browser an email everything that i have downloaded will be saved here that also include includes images assuming they were downloaded and apart from that you have folders like uh, movies music notifications uh, podcasts um, ringtones those folders are primarily empty assuming i haven't downloaded some kind of special app that uh, just saves directly to those folders um, so yeah you can check it if you're looking for something specific or if it's in there. And uh, anything else, uh, things like the folders, uh, music, or for instance, you know, music. Uh, if you place something uh, to one of those folders yourself, you can. Well, you will already know that something is in there. Uh, so yeah. Now once you find your files, you will want to select them. So let me quickly select mine. As you can see, once you find the files, uh, they will have this circle right here. Can simply tap on the circle to select your files as such uh, so that is one way you can do it or you can also select all of them uh, basically along with the folder by just holding the file as you can see the file but the folder i mean so if you hold it it gets selected and the outcome is basically the same whichever you do it it's completely up to you whichever way is more convenient that's probably the way you should go with but once you have selected the files uh, folder whatever it is uh, what you want to do then is choose if you want to either move it or copy it. Now right here we only have the move option visible. Under more we will have copy. Um, so select whichever one you want. Uh, move option will completely remove those files that are selected from here and move them to a new location while copy will create, create additional set of the same files and move them again also to the new location. I'm gonna go with move for this, this one. And once you select one of the options, it will bring up the storages. So we have the internal storage, the SD card, and also Google Drive if you are logged into Google. I'm gonna go with the SD card for now. And from here, you want to navigate into the folder uh, or location where you want to move them. Now I'm not really gonna be bothering with uh, finding a specific location. I'm just gonna select paste, and that will paste them right directly into the SD card folder, like you can see at the bottom here. Now also, if your files are located on the SD card, um, to access that SD card, I didn't actually show it. So when you're in here, by default, like I said, it opens up the internal storage. And if you want SD card, simply tap on the text on the drop down and select SD card. And from here, uh, we can continue the same way to select, uh, select your files that you want to move and then choose copy or move. So that is how you would move your files and if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching